Krishna Chatterjee and you are watching me on Discord.com. Well, very happy because um, it's released uh, in other parts of the world, uh, in Australia and New Zealand. It's an Australian film and now we are really happy to show it to the Indian audiences, yes. Uh, it is going to release in the Middle East and the US as well, oh. yeah. It has been really good and uh, it was wonderful working with the entire team, with our director, Mr. Anupam Sharma, um, and uh, Brett Lee and uh, Supriya Pathak, Akash Kurana, and uh, all the other Australian cast and uh, really happy that on the 19th of August it's releasing here. Yeah, it, it, it has been fun uh, and I think our director, Mr. Anupam Sharma, he just put us in these beautiful locations all around Sydney um, and there was a very handsome man sitting in front of me and it's a dating film as well so all I was doing in the first few weeks is like sipping some nice coffee and having great food and sitting in the most stunning locations in a beautiful weather in Sydney and flirting with a very handsome man Mr. Brett Lee. <laughs> so in short that's how I felt about an Indian. <laughs> well, um, I play a character called Mira in the film and um, what I actually liked about the script and the, and the character is that it's very contemporary, it's very today's. Um, she's a single mother, she has a, a very good job, she's very educated, she's fiercely independent, she's the marketing head of a very big company. and. Uh, <clears throat> Uh, she is a good mother and she's a good daughter. She fits into the bracket of, you know, <laughs> apostrophes that you know what, the the no the perfect woman that you know that you always think that a woman should be. But she's also herself and an individual, and that's what the film also celebrates. So when she's not, she doesn't think that okay she has to find a man. But when she does meet Will um, and she falls in love with him, she stands by her love. You know. And she, uh, in spite of certain differences or that she has with the previous generation, yeah. Um, I think it's a very good trend in the last two, three years again. Certain films, uh, you know, it started off with some of Vidya Balan's films and now Priyanka Chopra and Kangana Ranawat, Deepika Padukone, Anushka. Everybody is doing films which are also woman-centric and women protagonists and it's a fantastic trend and I think yeah I'm very happy about it and I celebrate it along with them. Um, I think the, yeah, the next release is a film called Parched and uh, you will hear about it more soon. It's about three women and uh, and then Lion yeah it's being premiered in Toronto. Um, it's, uh, it's not an Indian film. Uh, it's an Australian, British, American like sort of co-production but an Australian director again I think I'm having a love, love affair with Australia um, and it uh, has Nicole Kidman, Dev Patel, Rooney Mara, Nawazuddin, me amongst many other you know actors yeah. okay. sixth time <laughs> in it's sixth time but in three consecutive years as well yes 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 I think yeah I'm a regular in Toronto uh, uh, Last year I had Parched and Angry Indian Goddesses premiering there. The year before that I had a, a Canadian film premiering. And my first ever big film was a German film which opened in Toronto. That was the first time I went there. Brick Lane opened in Toronto. Road Movie, which Dave Benegal had directed, uh, that premiered there. Uh, so yeah, it's, <laughs> it's fantastic, yes. I have to admit that I watch... Uh, I watch Bollywood also like you know the last one month I've been out quite a bit so I don't know what's happened in the last one month. Tanu as Manu returns. <laughs> Women centric. <laughs> I love them all. I love many of them and I wouldn't want to single out because there's so many so many who are lovable. Supriya ji I mean wow that's the word I have for her like really um, she's a sweetheart. We had the song and dance routine as well, but no tree. No <laughs> yeah, Brett always keeps missing the tree. Okay. Well, I, I wouldn't reveal everything. There is song and dance as well. Uh, because it, it is, like I said, it's an Australian film with a lot of Indian flavor. And that's why it says that things are about to get spicy. Um, actually, even I heard it just now, so I don't know <laughs> what to say because I don't know what's happening yet okay. about it. So, yeah, I mean, well, I, 
I think I've repeated these thoughts many times and I'll just repeat myself that I think it's certification that we need not censorship. I cannot endorse a fairness cream because I'm not fair. How can I endorse it? I really appreciate that. I really appreciate that about her. I think all these uh, types of things that we endorse sometimes, you know, about body types as well, whether you're skinny, whether you're chubby, whether you're tall, whether you're shorty, you know, these things that we sort of endorse and not endorse. Um, of course, nobody can say that you should do this, but I personally feel that, yeah, we should be more responsible towards endorsing anything that is making um, the other feel that, oh, I don't have the height, I don't have the color, I don't have the body type, you know, any of those things. Brett and me, <laughs> number, one. number one, beautiful locations in uh, Sydney shot very well, beautiful to look at. The wit humor which is layered with a very, very contemporary story. Hi, this is Tanishtha Chatterjee and you are watching me on Biscuit.com. For more Bollywood updates, subscribe now to YouTube.com slash Biscuit TV.